I'm literally gonna murder this guy's cat. I'm I'm just like doing like all kinds of tricks. I'm like going crazy. Like now is the one time that I want to swing around, do a bunch of flips and stuff. Like this cat is not surviving. I saved your cat, then I accidentally killed it on the swing back because I like floated upside down and it just happened to fall out. It was unpreventable. Hey, I'm Swarly and this is Swarly Games and we're back playing Spider-Man Miles Morales. Now, um, I had to end it in the middle of a mission because of how this game is structured, but last time we took inspiration from my dad and didn't show home, uh, show up and come home with the milk, um, but I understand he was blown up by terrorists, so he gets a pass this time, but don't let it happen again. I just can't believe he wasn't there at Christmas. What kind of dad doesn't show up to Christmas with his family? A dead one? Yes. So I guess he's off the hook for that also. My uncle didn't recognize my voice, so I'm gonna confront him next time when I have like the, the bigger Christmas, the other Christmas that he's a part of. I'm gonna be like, hey, you didn't recognize me when I was Spider-Man. What, what, what's wrong with you, man? What's your deal? Uh, you don't care about your nephew? I bet you didn't even get me anything either. The last video, um, I'm just swinging around now. Just not even paying attention to the game. Um, because I don't want to, I don't want to progress. I need to keep talking and get this over with. I had this buzzing in the background because I had my controller plugged in. Um, so now I know not to do that. I would just swap to the other controller, which happens to have stick drift. But it's a sacrifice I have to be willing to make. All right, now we can finally go to this triangle, this love triangle, because I love it so much. When you knock people out, they're usually only, unless if it's like really bad, they're usually only out for like a few seconds. Like, maybe 10 seconds. Um, so obviously this would never work. But we're playing Spider-Man right now. We don't care about realism. Nice! That wouldn't have done anything, but whatever. Oh! Okay. Um, oh, oh, oh! Yeah! Boom! That's pretty cool. Yeah, it is, it is kind of always this easy. But it's the most frustrating thing, editing a video, and seeing all the jokes that you missed, being like, what is wrong with me? So it's like you're just waiting to get back into the next video so you can do a better job. Let me say that last one sucked. This one's gonna be way better, and I'm gonna say the the same thing next video. Um, Tinkerer, Unc said that's their leader. Oh, wait, how would he know that? He's like, oh, I'm not working with them. I just happened to hear one of them mention who their leader was, and what he looks like, and where he lives, and everything. I don't, I don't work with them though. Gonna have to get the trains back on the tracks by hand. It's like, I understand there's criminals here, but I don't think they even knew that there were criminals here when they sent me. They were just like, hey, Spider-Man, the trains aren't working. How does Spider-Man know how to turn the trains back on? And why wouldn't he just get workers in here to do it? Should work. Because he's probably not going to do as good of a job as they would. But I see some scaffolding that needs to be pulled down. Because, like, I saved you guys from the criminals. The least you could do is pick up my trash when I destroy your things, like... I think I deserve that, that pleasure from destroying your work. But anyway, whenever I tell people, um, that whole crisis of like, you know, you come up with great jokes when you're editing, but not when you're actually in the video, um, they're always like, just dub over it. Just add the jokes in later. I'm like, no, I'm not going to do that because I'd be like a freestyle rapper just being like, like, they're like, oh, that one was really good. And he's like, oh yeah, I may have written that one. You can't do that. It needs to be low quality. If it's too high, people will suspect things. Seriously, I would never dub over a video just to add in another joke if I missed one. Even, uh, especially not a super mediocre one. But Miles was definitely not trained for any of this. Three cars? Why? Why? Why would I do that? We've got trains on the tracks. We already had trains. Now they need power. Now they need power. But they were like, general. "Yeah, Spider-Man, you're already there, so you might as well." Do I have like? Oh, nice. I guess Spider-Man didn't want to give me his electric webs. He's like, "You already got the electric. Just deal with it." And then we just send the train off on its way. I mean, I would. He. I would have messed that up. I know I would. Yeah, we got the snowman as collectibles. Oh, come on, okay, I didn't get to throw that one, but at least it's completely destroyed, because, let me tell you, childhood trauma makes the best superheroes. Like I said in the last video, destroying that kid snowman is the best we can do, because then we're gonna get a sidekick when we're about Spider-Man's age. Sort of making it up as I go. 
The mark of a true Spider-Man. Yeah, Spider-Man, and then you like get people killed. Oh, MJ needs me. Gotta go. Bye. MJ needs you. Yeah, sure she does. Um. Oh. The subways made the app blow. No, and then that's MJ calling me, and she's like, "No, nothing's going on. What's up?" Spider Man's gonna get arrested for sexual assault or theoretical assault. A little bit less jail time. Only a little. Childhood trauma, it's a double edged sword because it also makes the best super villains. Some guy's gonna come back and he's gonna be like, You destroyed my snowman, you bastard. I spent three hours making that snowman up on the roof of a building. Why did you destroy it? And then, that was a snowman in a construction site. So these people aren't even getting to work. I actually, I don't, I don't mean to be, you know, a hero or anything. Don't call me a hero. Um, but like, I don't care about getting a copyright claim on the videos uh, and like having them demonetized forever because, you know, I might not ever make money from them. Um, but it's just a bummer. And the problem is literally only that I don't know how the copyright system works. Like, I don't know if, if, if I could get a copyright strike from that, which is a much bigger deal. So that's why I'm turning off the music, even though it's a very important part of this game. Do we not have police officers? Oh, there they are. I already, I already did it for you guys. Just wanted you to have more time to relax. I didn't want you to be in any hurry or anything. I'm gonna go up and deal with the next one, but I'll see you once I'm done with that. Uh-oh. I'm over here flexing my, like, all my different moves when I need to be worrying about this bomb. I know they're gonna relax and let me do it. Thanks, guys, it means a lot. What's going on with this girl's hair? We got the Karens joining the group? That's kind of crazy. I mean, like, I'm actually worried for my safety now. Like, I, I, don't, I don't care about all these guys putting bombs on the tracks, but if a Karen's doing it, like, that's gonna be hard to stop. We're the strongest. What kind of banter is that? You know, how restaurants make you upsell when business isn't doing great? Um, they must have, like, a list of comments to say during, during fights. Like, we're the strongest and don't mess with blank. Undergrounded a number on my suit. Could do a patch job. Are you serious? It's like every mission, my suit's gonna get damaged and I have to get a new one. Oh no, my shoes got dirty, I gotta spend another hundred dollars. I'm not gonna worry about any of this side stuff until after I am done with this you okay, playthrough. Because I, you guys don't want to see that, yeah. but you don't want to see any of this anyway. You're only right. here because you pity me. So it doesn't really matter. One year unlimited subway pass. Oh, thanks so much! Did I get the name right? How did you... Wait. Um, okay, gotta go. So he, okay. So he knows. Don't worry. I won't tell your mom. I mean, it's a Spider-Man story. She probably already knows. Everybody already knows when you're Spider-Man. And they're all just lying to you. You get in over your head, you give me a call. I'm here for you. Oh, yeah, absolutely. Whenever I need help fighting bad guys, or like some super villain with crazy energetic powers, I'll call you. I do love how like he's the amateur Spider-Man and he can't get that wrinkle to go away. New side mission. I'm not going to do that, but what is Oh no. I don't want to. I want to, but I can't. Unless if it's good. Oh, Tails Bodega. Have you heard of the underground? And I think they've been recruiting kids around the neighborhood. Oh, nice. Thanks, mom. Thanks for the tip. Uncle Aaron told me about him. Uh, yeah. I ran into him at the subway stop by our house. She's like, you know you're Spider-Man, right? No, you know I don't want you around him. What? But you and Dad never told me why I wasn't allowed to see him anymore. That's for Aaron to explain. If he's such a bad guy, why would we let? Why would we want him to explain it? Go save the world, Mom. We'll vote out of Aaron is such a horrible person, and the person who's going to tell you how bad he is should be him. That makes perfect sense. Okay, now I normally would not do a side quest while playing you know, on the channel. But this is about that coconut milk. I'm back at Teo's Bodega. We gotta get that coconut milk. Spider-Man! Spider-Man! Man, where are you hiding? You have terrible eyesight. Hey, um, right here. What? Not you, my cat. Oh, Named okay. After the real Spider-Man. I could have been out there catching real criminals, but I was here following you. Sure, kid. Guess it can't hurt. I mean, 
Guess it can't hurt. He must be a Spider-Man fan if he named his cat after Spider-Man. Oh, there it is. I found your cat, sir. It's right on the other side of your door. They're shooting Transformers? They're shooting Transformers here. This is where they shoot the movies. It's hilarious. It's a funny joke. You can all laugh now. He's in the middle of a conversation, but yeah, it's totally safe to do a, t a stealth takedown. He's like, oh, all my friends are gone. That's not alarming to me. He's gonna have abandonment issues, but I guess not now, because he's going to prison. He has to say that every time? Yeah, the doctor said he needs a stool sample. You're like, is this sufficient? Boom! Hilarious joke. There is a lot of grunting going on over there. Can you guys just cool it? Alright, it's Christmas time. I don't have a tree here, so I thought I would just hang you guys from that bar. Okay. Yeah, punching the electronics would help. I mean, my GPU overheats, so I just like electrify my fist and then punch my GPU. That wouldn't be very good. Spider-Man! Wait! Wait! I'm coming for you, Spider-Man. Do you guys think groaning and moaning over there is gonna make me rescue you? There's nobody here that's gonna hear you. Spider-Man! He's wearing headphones, that's a rookie mistake. I would never wear headphones. I really want there to be like an actual plot point where Spider-Man gets caught because he's making some stupid joke. That's what I would do. I'd be like in an armed robbery and I'd be joking about, you know, making fun of the guy's shoes or something and i get shot. Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. This is gonna be, this should be cool, but it's actually gonna be really anticlimactic. Let's check it out. Yeah, of course, because the range is horrible. That's what I said when I was looking at, uh, you know, stove tops and ovens at uh, Lowe's. I was like, this one's got convection bake, but the range is horrible. It's funny, really funny. It says do not enter, but it's probably talking about the door. So I'm gonna go in the vent, just to be respectful. I mean, Spider-Man must have done some good work um, teaching me because Spider-Man after eight years didn't know all those moves that we learned in the last game. And now Miles already knows them. We're looking for the breaker box. I hardly know her. <laughs> Whenever you need to power these computers, your bar is already full. Too bad it's uh, last call, so they all have to leave. It's funny. It's really funny. Let there be. Are you just now responding to? Oh, I I don't want to kill him now. It's like a guy wearing glasses. It's like, are you gonna punch a guy wearing glasses? Or like Key and Peel? Are you gonna hit a guy with a baby? He's got a cat on him. You can't have him. Huh. Don't you know it's rude to interrupt the bonding process? The bonding process? Wait, the, is he talking about like bonding chemicals or literally bonding with this cat? Because I respect it. You know, I don't want to kill this guy. He, he does show empathy when it comes to cats. He has good morals when it comes to cats. And I always said I've always been a strong believer in uh, cat lives being more important than people. I'm not going to make a cat life matter joke. And when I say I'm not going to make a joke, I'm making a joke in the process. There you go. That guy took a lot. Like, he was he was fueled by his ambition to protect this cat. Now, come on, I can't even throw him? Miles, I know you're in high school and you weigh like 100 pounds, but you should be able to pick up this 300-pound muscular guy. I mean, that cat would be able to get out of that. The cat's out of the bag now. Yay! That guy was gonna power the own the switch that he didn't want to hey, by putting man. that cat on there if he had How been feeding it too much. Yay! I'm gonna keep your cat if you don't mind. I'm literally gonna murder this guy's cat. I'm I'm just like doing like all kinds of tricks. I'm like going crazy. Like now is the one time that I want to swing around, do a bunch of flips and stuff. Like this cat is not surviving. I saved your cat, then I accidentally oh, killed it on the swing back because I like there. floated Almost upside there. down and it just happened to fall out. It was unpreventable. It's gonna look like a drug hey, deal. Tail. No animals! What a narcissist. What a hypocrite. What's I got that? you your cat. Now hand over the coconut milk. <gasps> Spider Man! He probably Dude, preferred the other oh, guy. Yes, so now he's gonna be did. not the oh, same to yes, his original did. owner. I don't know if you guys can endure more of these jokes. I'm only like a little more than halfway through the video or the recording. I guess I could be right at the end of the video if I just do a horrible job at commentary from now on. Challenge accepted. Oh hey, my favorite podcast. Can you hear a story that you just can't get out of your head? Maybe I can't hear your voice out of my head. Now turn this crap off. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. 
I was about to get praised for all my work. Instead, I had to stop and do more work. <laughs> I'm not about that lifestyle. I only want, you know, sunshine up my butt instead of actually doing the work to earn it. I just got the podcast turned off because that criminal had to be driving down the street. Why couldn't he take the subway like a normal New Yorker? Also, speaking of New Yorkers, why is this street so open? Like, I understand it's a video game and it needs to run properly, but like, these streets should be filled with cars. You know, if there's one of these signs up, if there's something destructible on top of the building, you know a helicopter's gonna go through that at some point, or some kind of monster or something. Like, that sign's not staying up. I gotta notify the owner to order a replacement sign. Hey, Molasses! Wait. Up here! Molasses? Fire That's racist. Fire than it used to be. Careful on the way up. Oh, don't worry. I'll just walk up the wall. You would save yourself so much time if you just came out to all these people. That's what people tell me, and I'm like, guys, for the last time, I'm not gay. You remember the combination? Yeah, yeah I'm always uh, looking at my combo on the top left of the screen. It's a hilarious joke. Please uh, laugh, by all means. Wait. Okay. You kidding me? You gonna take that job at Roxxon or what? Uh oh. <laughs> Why? You gonna take it if I don't? Maybe. Waiting to see the offer. Okay. So it, we're pulling that cliche, well, it's where this game. evil company oh, has been around forever and we never heard about them. You guys fight or something? Wait, no. what? No fight. No. Finn. It's fine. Why do we really lose touch? Hey. Just debating like have stuff we're not sharing. how Next low hang, how low I can no go secrets. on these quality of the jokes. Because okay. I would say, mm, I would maybe. say if I had higher standard or lower standards, if you're on time. I would say that if you See did you lose soon, touch, all stuff. your other senses would be enhanced. You know I'm taller than you now, right? But I'm not, not going to say that. Oh, great. Yeah, he gave me that. He I mean, Obviously, he knows I'm Spider-Man. I'm Spider-Man. He gives me that subway pass. I'm like, great, thanks. I'm faster than the subway. And better. I smell better. Fewer crazy people inside me. That's not what I just said. I said something else. Um, <laughs> what was I going to say? I was going to say something. Oh, right. I was going to stop talking. That's what I was going to do. I can't believe I haven't made... Check. An exaggerated oh swagger God. of a black teen Check. joke. I mean, that seems like the go-to, so I'm proud of myself. Even though I just forgot. I'm not better than that or anything. We're gonna be late! You know, Genki, you seem like the character that I'm going to forget about immediately after I turn this oh, game hey. off. After <laughs> getting 100% completion, that's what she said. Okay, it's not there yet. I'm just gonna pretend that those are my hands up there. Not even two people. Those are both my hands. I am on the mural. I'm taking it. Oh, great. Look at these guys. Why are they so decked out? What do they think is going to happen? But, I mean, I guess it is New York in the Spider-Man universe. Everything is a lockdown, even if it's like a little kid's lemonade stand. The city, but they won't tell us the risk. Hey, last time my dad was on stage. This message is now my mom's on stage. Don't you dare. Stay back. Stay home. Nowhere to run. They got unique hairstyles, too. I'll give them that. And my mom is just calmly escorting people off the stage. This way, please, single file. I mean, why wouldn't you go after the political I got you. Um, person? I can't think of the word. A better word. Um, who's on stage. Like, not that I want you to go after my mom. Wink. Oh, okay. They went straight for the guards. I appreciate it. However, if they did kill both my mom and dad, my powers would be enhanced, given uh, superhero logic. I'm not just driving your mom to the hospital. Okay? Oh yeah, she just she wanted to go for the refreshments. Don't worry. They have uh, cookies and magazines in the lobby. The I, oh, and I missed the entire thing because I decided to make a horribly mediocre joke and then I get hit by a bomb. I deserve all of this. Okay, I'm about to die. If I do though, I'm gonna re-hear all of this dialogue. Okay. Oh, okay. Come on, mom. My dad died because he was pushing people off the... Or, no, he pushed the guy with the bomb away from the other people. And sacrificed himself. And then he died because of it. So you should know to get yourself out first. Where are you? I'm at home. But I can come to the hospital. Yeah, I'm at home. I'm just doing something really strenuous. So it sounds like you called at the wrong time. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Mom. I mean, that's like what you say to your friends, and they're not even interested, but like, 
saying it to your son, obviously he would be able to. Just don't put like a poop joke on there. That's what I would do. They'll look for someone to blame for all this, and it won't just be Tinker. They're already blaming me. I'm Spider-Man. You know this. They're gonna look for Spider-Man to blame. Like, they can already do that. They already know who I am. You say that you're at home when she calls, and she's like, why are you panting so much? Go, go, go! Let's not shoot Yeah, other, let's just right? talk this out. You guys are great at that. Oh no. It's the Tinkerer. I hardly know her. And that's true. I don't I don't know her. This is the first time seeing her. I'm not even sure what new form is. I mean, I know it's like a power supply to power the thing that's going to power Harlem, that's going to power the world, which is going to power something else probably. Then grab as much as you can carry. Yeah, okay. What, what are you guys even thinking? Let's just push Spider-Man into this railing and hope nothing bad happens. Oh my god! Oh my god! The gain on my microphone is freaking out. That was so... That's Finn! What? That's like... Phineas, I know what we're gonna do today. That's me taking the magnet off of my chair. Putting it back on. He says verb. I know what we're gonna do today. So I guess Finn knows what we're gonna do. We're gonna steal from Roxxon today. And then, you know, you're gonna be so busted. Hilarious joke. I could have pulled that out much better. And once again, my suit is ruined. Why does this always happen? It's almost like being Spider-Man is dangerous. Did you see the tinkerer? Hey, I mean, I've ignored some red flags in my day. I think this is excusable. I, I've heard people say that the pacing of the first Spider-Man um, was not very good. I really liked it. And like this game, yes, it is going like really fast, like that. You're like, what? Already? We're already seeing who the bad guy is and it's somebody we would never suspect? Because that's what I was thinking. I was like, oh, it's Finn. I'm, I'm gonna say that as a joke, but that's even worse than the jokes I usually say because it means nothing because it could never be possible. And it's not even a prediction. But, like, that was unexpected. Hmm. Yeah, like, we're just gonna hold up the entire bridge. Uh, I don't know what we do in this situation. Hey, everybody, get off the bridge! <laughs> Take my advice. Oh, here we go, water. Who's thirsty? Oh, great, it's labeled as water. That's what you always see. Ah, uh, who cares? Oh, whoops, my bad. There was a, a, a blockade in the way. Sorry, guys. Uh, I said that. You think you're saving the day? You deserve to die, my friend. Oh, maybe you won't, actually. I take that back. Oh. I'm gonna throw you through this glass. Are you okay? And there happened to be a boat right here. Can I? Oh, I can pull that. Nice. It's totally safe. I've done this before. Save all the cars. That's thousands of dollars, Miles. What's wrong with you? Oh my god. I mean, this girl, her neck would be broken from swinging around all over the place like that, but so would Spy. Uh, they could see you're black! Right now, she's gonna tell all her friends and, you know, ruin your reputation even though you just this. saved her. You could just. Go off the bridge. You're Spider-Man. Go off the bridge and swing under it. Oh, nice. Where'd he go? It just happens to happen. It all works out. Here today is Simon Krieger, but his what, what did you call it? Bioelectricity. Oh, come on. They, he he told me that I had promise. Now he's taking it back just because I killed a few people. I mean, Fuller de Coco would be great. If you don't mind. Listen, if you mess this up, if it's too watery or whatever, I'm not voting when for you. Power, whenever you say Spider-Man, you always mean the other one. Yeah, I'm just trying not to confuse you. You can fix this. Your way. I'm just gonna call myself Spider-Man and he's gonna be like, wait, what, what, which one? And I'm gonna be like, you told me. Oh, there's supposed to be music. Okay, whenever the sound just randomly cuts out, there's got to be music. I got to start singing something to fill the space. Oh, okay. Oh, ne never mind. Okay. But no, I can't. Literally, like, I love to sing, but I can't do it in my videos because 
of copyright reasons. So it's like, I need to make my own song, which I can't do. Oh, nice. Come on! She just made that for you. This is pretty cool. And it's got to be destroyed whenever I do my next mission. You're catching pigeons, and by the end he's like, wow, my suit is all messed up. Those pigeons really did a number on my new suit. That's exactly what he's going to say. Oh, great, a time trial. Whenever I'm playing a game and I see that, what looks like a clock, I'm like, no. It's getting clock blocked today. I'm leaving. Yeah, I don't need help. I'm just like, you know, my mom might die. There's like a whole crisis. The world is exploding. But you're fine. Just keep sipping that pina colada wherever you are. You don't need to worry about this. I will handle it and I will fail, but I will learn from these mistakes and maybe lose my parents in the process. But who cares, you know? I need to be independent anyway. They keep coddling me. I would love to just swing around and talk about stupid stuff for another hour and then have another like five hours of editing to do because of it, but I'm going to end it right there. So to you and you only because nobody else made it to the end of the video. Good night, good luck, and get me out of here.